Hey guys, I'm Nick from Micro Center. I'm sure you've noticed with Windows 8 there are two Internet Explorer icons. There's one at the Start menu and there's one at the Desktop. They're both Internet Explorer or so they look. There's just a couple minor differences. We got a video today showing you what the differences are between the Internet Explorer Desktop and the one from the Start menu. So let's get started. Alright, from your Start menu, one of the tiles is labeled Internet Explorer. If you left click on that, that'll open up your new user interface, Internet Explorer 10 for Windows 8. Um, with Windows 8, there's actually a second Internet Explorer. So if we take our mouse and we can go, I have the desktop open, but we'll go back to the Start menu and we'll left click on Desktop. And then I can left click on the blue E for Internet Explorer and this will bring up Internet Explorer 10 for Windows 8 as well. Now, see the difference between this one here and the one at the desktop are more subtle differences than anything else. Um, we'll take a quick overview of this one here. This is your standard Internet Explorer that you've been seeing since Windows 98, I guess, um, or even earlier. You are at the top is your taskbar, um, your URL bar, your address bar is right here, tabs are right here, home page, uh, favorites and settings, and scroll bar at the right hand side, uh, back forward, and your close, minimize, and resize buttons. Let's go take a look at the new user interface Internet Explorer. So this is what you usually see. Pretty similar. You still have your search bar, or so that, but your tabs are gone, and so are your uh, settings and everything else. Well, to get to those, and just like most of the new user interface tiles and applications, you just right click, and there you go. Everything just appears. Um, at the top are your tabs. I can add a new tab. If I right click again, I can go to change some settings, I can close all the tabs, I can do a new in private tab. Then at the bottom here, I can you know, pin this site, I can go to the page tools and view on the desktop. So if I want to view something on the desktop, let's say I go to yahoo.com for just an example here, and I click on this wrench here, and I click view on desktop. This will take me to the desktop and open up the page here. Um, the benefit of that is if for whatever reason the site you're on does not like this new Internet Explorer, you can just pop right over to the standard Internet Explorer in, from the desktop and hopefully it works there. Um, no real major differences from there. Um, you can actually close out of Internet Explorer from the desktop by clicking the X. And with this one here, just like any of the new user interface um, applications, you take your mouse, throw it to the top till it turns into a hand, left click, and drag it all down to the bottom. And once that snaps down there, just let go. And that'll get you back to your start menu, and you can continue to use Windows 8 however you want. Um, if you have any more questions, feel free to get in contact with us at microcentertech.com.